we're making display cases today. These we originally designed, or Stan originally designed, to hold our bee art, but they were really useful for holding just one frame of bees for um, Ag in the Classroom and Farmer's Markets, and so we're selling them all over the country. So here is Stan working on these. He's assembled them and he's getting them ready to varnish. Stan, tell us some of the features about these. A uh, new feature this year, I've put a uh, dowel here so that there's no way you can get this on the wrong way. The reason we want you to put it back the same way is so the screws line up and so the uh, dado, the groove, the glass groove lines up so you don't put it on there and pinch it and crack the glass. That kind of thing. So that's a new feature now. So it holds one frame. This is just, uh, this is not an observation hive really, it's a display case observation hive. You only want to put one frame of bees in here just for the fair, right? Just for the day and then put them back in their hive. So one frame will fit in here. You'll have glass on both sides. Some manufacturers make their frames an inch and an eighth. Some make them one inch. So it'll accommodate the larger size frame here. It has uh, some feet on there to keep uh, keep it from tipping over. It has glass rather than plexiglass. If you're concerned about the glass breaking, bees getting loose in a classroom or something, you may want to put plexiglass in it or tempered glass. Um, as long as it doesn't tip over, you'll be just fine. Um, it has ventilation holes on the side. These will have a screen over them so that uh, humidity doesn't build up inside the hive and fog up the glass. The bees can breathe. Yeah, it will act like a solar oven. So you don't want to leave this if you're uh, at a farmer's market. Uh, you don't want to leave it in the sunlight all day long. Your bees will get too hot in there. So it needs to be in the shade. That's our economical one frame observation hive at the honey company. How's it doing? Are you selling a lot of them? They're very popular. I mean, it's a product that we didn't expect to be uh, that popular. I didn't build it with intent to sell really. I built it to house my bee art um, and uh, people like them for uh, observation hives for events. It's the event observation hive. Mm -hmm. What do you finish it with? Uh, we put um, varnish on it, spar varnish, so it's a natural wood color. You can uh, put whatever you, know, whatever you want on it. Some people finish them with tongue oil. There's an infinite variety of finishes you can put on beehives.